Hey guys, John here. Today we're in Vital and let's make a cool lead. So let's go to a new preset and one of my favorite waveforms inside Vital is in the init, in the factory, and then it is the low high fold, this guy right here. So putting this at about halfway here, we get that kind of cool texture and let's go with, for an envelope and put this on the wavetable. It's going to dial this in a little bit, little bit. So let's reduce the sustain, not all the way. Maybe a little bit faster uh, decay here. So we get that kind of cool sound, maybe a little bit of release. And then go to oscillator 2, and let's give this some voices here. Drop this down an octave here. And let's go to a filter, and let's turn this on for both oscillators. And maybe envelope three to modulate the filter here. And bring the sustain down. Maybe let's try the dirty 24. Give it some drive. Okay, so let's give it a little bit of release here for the main envelope. And let's hop into some of our effects here. So one of the cooler ones is adding the chorus and kind of reducing the mix here. And some glide always goes a long way and select always glide. And that's some delay here. Let's go to a mid ping pong and eighth notes are fine for this. Let's kind of EQ this just a little bit and reduce the mix. And we can add some distortion here. Let's leave it on the soft clip and kind of just give it a little bit of hair on it. And maybe EQ the mud out just a little bit. And then let's give it some reverb here and tie this whole thing in together. It's a pretty quick patch to make, but it is definitely a fun one here. So let's give us a good amount of mix here. Give us some low cut. And maybe we are going to reduce this a little bit. I'm curious what a multi-band would sound like at this here on the top. Reduce the release here for the main envelope. It almost sounds like a little bit of a distorted, distorted guitar down here on the cutoff.
Yeah, let's see what we can call this. Maybe like distorted something, distorted machine. <laughs> I think this distorted machine might be kind of cool, and keep in mind, moving this cutoff here is going to be kind of cool. You can do a lot of cool stuff with that. So if you want to get distorted machines, there's a link in the video description below, and it can be yours. So hopefully you learned something. Check out this wavetable if you haven't already, low, high, fold. You can get a lot of cool textures out of that one. Uh, so yeah, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you in the next video.